What is up? Y'all know what to do. Let me know if you can hear me. Let me know if you can see me. Because again, I got notified my live is banned, but every time I try, it seems to be working. Shout out to all y'all in here. Let me know if you can hear me, if you can see me. Good? We good? Let me know if we good before I start answering questions. What is up? What is up? How's it going? Where y'all at? Where y'all located? How's the weather? Let me know. Can y'all hear me? We good? Perfect. Let's get it. So I guess we ain't banned. But again, if you in here, I got notified that my TikTok live was banned until October, but it's still working. So just in case everybody in here needs to go to my YouTube and to my Instagram and subscribe and follow. That way, in case we need to start going live over there. Shout out to New, New York City, Tampa, Florida, South Carolina, Baltimore, Cali. Comment y'all's questions. What's going on? We got some new, new features or something. See you. I can hear you. What is this? Somebody sent me an invite. What is that invite? Send it again. Send that invite again. Mississippi, South Carolina in the building. Dang, how do you do this? That's the host. Invite. I'm trying to figure out these new features. Comment those questions, though. Thank you, thank you. New York, Orlando in the building. Shout out to everybody. Sorry, I'm just trying to figure out these issues. Because I talked about a subject that I apparently was a little sensitive. So, I'm just eating a little acai bowl right now. Bear with me. Just trying to melt it a little bit. Strawberries, mangoes, agave nectar on top, not honey. We're not dealing with honey because honey is nothing but beet throw up that they use for their, their child. It's not for human consumption, right? You don't want to take beet throw up in your system, do you? Damn, let me show y'all. Tastes kind of weird. I just picked up all my juices. You know what I do? Kale apple gingers. Kale apple gingers, pressed juice for the week. Got like six, eight of those. Elderberry. This one's elderberry. Pressed elderberry. Then we got. Actually, I think that was it. Yeah, kale apple ginger, cucumber, and parsley. Then an elderberry drink. Nah, honey's not good for you. Don't deal with honey. Honey is beet throw up. I did a whole video on like 15 reasons why you shouldn't deal with honey. Pretty much any berry's good. This is strawberries, goji berries, blueberries, and mango. What's in place of honey? Agave nectar is fine. I think it's hard to eat and catch all those questions. My bad. When they got these strawberries big as hell. Mango with coconut on top. You know, I always talk about coconut. Yes, agave is good. It's low on the glycemic index. Use that instead of honey. I said save money, make your own juice, yeah, but I ain't got time. I got clients to take care of. Like, just pick it up, go to the fridge, bang, we good to go. Save time. Do what you got to do. I see. Comment y'all's questions, though. This is going live. I just replied to a bunch of comments of people looking to set up for coaching. If you want coaching, you know what to do. 40 for one month or 80 for three months. So you get a whole month free. If you need holistic healing, if you're dealing with something super specific to get rid of it, we do the holistic healing program. That one's 320, covers the full year. So you know what herbs to take, what amino acids, what vitamins, what minerals, how many milligrams, how many IUs, 
based on you and what you're specifically dealing with, whether it's kidney issues, liver issues, diabetes, cancer, doesn't matter what it is, blood pressure, doesn't matter. But let's get into these questions. Uh, from, I'm in California, so it depends on where you're at. If you have a juice spot where they press the juice for you, you'll be good to go. I know some places don't have that. That's when you get your own juicer and you make your own. I always start the day with the kale apple ginger. This is my first meal of the day. It's three o'clock. First thing I put in my system other than other than water. Cucumber and ginger is good. Sea moss is good for you as long as it's real sea moss. There we go. Damn. I started using some vanadium and bilberries. My diabetes is somewhat under control. Thank you. Happy to help. Happy to help. Need to lose 40 by October. You got to make sure you have a game plan. The biggest thing I see set people back is just freestyling, grabbing random routines, grabbing random meal plans, not having any structure. That's going to be your best way and quickest way to get the results and actually keep them off. Keep the weight off. You can tell the difference between sea moss if it's real thick and chunky. It's got a bunch of sea salt at the bottom. It's, it's fake sea moss. I mean, the bowl, mango, goji berries, strawberries, blueberries, coconut, agave, nectar on top. Um, what else we got? Cacao nips. Instead of using chocolate, use cacao. Cacao is the original chocolate. That's what they use to actually make chocolate. And they start mixing it with milk and making milk chocolate and all this other stuff. Only deal with cacao. So if you want something sweet, deal with cacao. Don't put no chocolate chips on your bowl and mess it all up. Yeah, if you're dealing with HPV, we knocking that out too. That's the one-on-one -on -one healing consultation. I don't put my client's business out there unless they give me permission to. But I have a few people I'm helping knock that out with right now. Getting good results, good progress. Yeah, dark chocolate's bad. Any chocolate's not good. It's highly acidic. Deal with cacao instead. Notice in my bowl, I don't get no bananas. I don't get no granola that they automatically add. I make sure to let them know. Don't add no granola. Don't add no bananas. Because I see that banana you're using. It's a fake hybrid GMO. Cavendish banana. The regular common banana we don't deal with that it causes mu more mucus in the body than almost any other thing you put in your damn mouth so hold the bananas on mine because i know you're not using baby or burrow bananas hold the granola because granola is highly acidic just like oatmeal is highly acidic right we don't need extra acid in the body how to join link is in the bio for everything you need from me uh grocery list i mean sorry the alkaline recipe book uh custom coaching one-on-one -on -one holistic healing program Link is in the bio. You click it. TikTok will ask you. Mm. <coughs> I choked on a goji berry. <coughs> TikTok will ask you. You sure you want to leave? You say yes. And you're good to go. Yeah, we're not dealing with no bananas except burrow or baby bananas. If I have any clients in here. Let them know how things are going. Post client testimonials daily. Let me take these off. Sun's kind of down now. Let you see my eyes. Six months straight. Six months straight. Client testimonials daily. Haven't missed a day. Dang, everybody asking <laughs> what's in the bowl. I didn't say what's in the bowl like 10 times now. We got strawberries, blueberries, mango, coconut, cacao nips, goji berries. Um, and agave and nectar on top. Yeah, if you're dealing with like severe arthritis, eczema that's affecting your life, you're tired of scratching, you're tired of being in pain, rheumatoid arthritis, I have many 
uh, people in my one-on-one -on -one healing consultation program where we knocking that out. <clears throat> I already posted client testimonials. I keep choking on this uh, coconut and the goji bears. I don't deal with black seed oil. That's why you see me never talk about it. Diane, yeah, they finally unbanned me. Diane, 10002, let them know how you feeling. Let them know your results. Let them know what's up, Diane. I know you commented on my YouTube video. Let me know your testimonial, how your health's getting better. So if you want, let the people know. Yeah, we're not dealing with oatmeal. Oatmeal's acidic. Use spelt flakes instead. Intermittent fasting's great. <clears throat> That's pretty much what I do. Again, this is my first thing I put in my system today other than water. It's 3 o'clock. Yes, I agree with Dr. Sabi's teachings. I also learned from many others, though. But primarily, um, I deal with his information. I learned directly from people who traveled the world with him. One of my closest friends was healed from, guess what? Type 1 diabetes. Because you see all the comments, you can't do anything about type 1. Type 1, you can't do anything. Stop telling people. My best friend was losing his leg, was losing his eyesight, was down there going blind, was about to be amputated from type 1 diabetes. And guess what? Dr. Sebi healed him completely. Now we go play ball together all the time. His leg's perfectly fine. He sees me perfectly fine. Doesn't take insulin. Not on dialysis. None of that. But hey, I'll be making stuff up though. I know. I know. But anyways, Dr. Sebi healed him, and now he teaches around the world, healing thousands, and that's who I'm taught directly by. So along with years and years of going to other seminars and educating myself, spending all my free time on learning the knowledge, and actually putting it into practice, because it's, it's nothing to just talk about it, but you're not producing any results. The difference is I'm producing results after results after results, dramatic testimonials, people that no longer have cancer, no longer have diabetes, no longer have high blood pressure, no longer on medication, no longer having seizures, no longer having anxiety attacks, whatever. No longer having kidney issues, no longer having liver issues, no longer having cysts, no longer having fibroids. Testimonial, six months straight, haven't missed a day. People with STDs, all that. Everybody asking what store I went to. I mean, I'm in LA, so there's so many different <clears throat> side stores and brands. Like, so if you're not in LA, me telling you which store I got this made at is kind of uh, pointless, right? Yeah, if you're dealing with something super specific, that's when you want the one-on-one -on -one healing consultation. That's full year access to me. You get my personal phone number to text me, call me, voice message me whenever you need. We do a con phone consultation first before I send out your plan. You get measurements of what you need, what herbs, how to mix them, where to get them, how many milligrams, how many IUs of vitamins, minerals, amino acids, what diet to follow, what foods to stay away from. We check in with each other as much as needed to make sure we're knocking out these issues. I don't use specific words. Because as we see, I got a notification from TikTok two days ago saying that my live was gonna be banned until October. It just so happens that they're still letting me speak, so maybe it was a mistake. But I have to be very careful with how I word things, what I say in my videos, all of that. Thank you, Diane. Hope I'm pronouncing that right. Diane said, I really recommend for everyone you can get his coaching and he will help you. Thank you, T-Walk. Yep. You are very welcome. I'm happy to hear your progress. I know you were dealing with something super serious. I know you commented publicly, but I'm not going to bring it up unless you do. Um, but yeah, 
Thanks for letting the people know. Be knocking these things out. Yeah, so in case they shut my page down, because again, they threatened to ban me, what you need to do is you need to go follow me on Instagram and follow me on YouTube. Because just in case it stops letting me go live on here, I'm going to start going live on my YouTube or on my Instagram. My name's spelled the same on everything. T Walk the Hawk, T Walk Dog Fitness. You put it in your search bar on YouTube, on Instagram, it's going to pop up. Chlorophyll water is great. I always put chlorophyll in my water. Chlorophyll comes naturally from plants. It helps you get more oxygen to your cells. The problem with most people is if you're dealing with a disease or illness, you have a disease, any disease at all, I don't care what it is. Don't say, well, what about this? What if I got this? What about this? What about that? Whatever disease you're dealing with, it's damaged cells in a specific area of your body. I don't care if it's autoimmune. I don't care if it's cancer. I don't care if it's diabetes. It's damaged cells in a specific area of your body. Many times those cells are damaged in most cases because the cells aren't getting enough oxygen. So we have to get oxygen to the cells by removing negative things that are causing oxygen to not be able to get to the cells or restricting your blood flow and circulation. One of the things that helps with that is chlorophyll, adding that to your water, it adds helps you get oxygen to the cells. So anytime you're drinking water, put a little chlorophyll in it. Great point, great question. For all y'all asking what I'm eating, I done answered like 20 times, but I know we get new people in here. Mango, strawberry, goji berry, agave nectar sprinkled on top, coconut, blueberry, bowl, yeah. Help with MS. If you're dealing with MS, you need to be eating nothing but fruit. Fruit helps regenerate the cells. Fruit also, when you're dealing with a neurological issue, it's one of the best things for a neurological issue, which MS is, right? If you're dealing with movement, paralysis, Parkinson's, anything like that, fruits are going to, they're electric for your electric body, protons, electrons, new, neutrons, ions, that's what your body's made of, electric things, yet you're eating nothing but dead things and wondering why you don't feel energized, you're wondering why your battery's not charged, because you're trying to charge your battery with dead things, you're putting dead batteries into your remote and wondering why the damn buttons ain't working, that's what's happening. Yeah, I have people dealing with heart issues. Knock all that out. It's the one-on-one healing consultation for those of you asking about really specific things. I can't just give you the one thing here on the live because everyone's different. Everyone's situation is more severe, less severe. You might be dealing with cancer of the blood, cancer of the kit. Like, it's different for everyone. That's why I'm like, all right, so many people I'm now knowing are dealing with these specific issues. I'm going to come up with the one-on-one healing consultation program so we can really get super specific about these super specific issues, right? Um, but if you're just looking for weight loss, maybe get your blood pressure down, get your cholesterol down, feel more confident, improve your mental health, right? So you're not depressed, you're not stressed out because of your weight, you're fitting your favorite clothes again, you can shop where you want. That's the one-on-one -on -one custom coaching. One month is 40 or three months for 80. I under promise, over deliver, you see the client testimonials. Many people that do what I do aren't even giving you nearly as much. They're charging 200, 500 a month, even more. Um, but yeah, but enjoy the free information. That's why I do these lives. I'm catching the questions I can. I do a live pretty much daily. I post videos daily. And for 11 months straight, I posted three new videos a day. I just started kind of slowing down on that because I want to make sure that I'm catering to my clients also. So it takes a lot of time to record three videos a day, edit three videos a day, make sure they're posted for you, plus reply to comments, plus reply to my clients. So now I post like one video a day. Hmm. If you're dealing with thyroid issues, be taking bladder rack daily. It's a herb, bladder rack. It's 
Somebody said he's definitely not an MD. He's a CPT. It doesn't matter what I am. I would never want to be an MD, right? Because an MD is taught by the same, by the same people who constantly are keeping you on medicine, keeping you sick. 